A threat of uh, severe weather and of course uh, tropical system is going to keep the humidity so high here. We're getting uh, more concerned uh, for tomorrow uh, for the possibility of flash flooding, especially those of you north of the capital region. And we all have the chance at getting some strong to severe thunderstorms. Let's take a look outside right now. We'll go through all the nitty gritty for you coming up shortly. The view up in Glens Falls tonight, uh, bright sunshine. It was up close to 90, of course, very high levels of humidity. Quick check at the temps right now. And then we're going to get into the remnants of Beryl. 93 in Voorheesville, Glenmont 94. By the way, the high in Albany 92. We had some cloudiness that prevented the temperature from going up higher. 87 in Cobleskill, 89 in Chatham, Pittsfield 86, North Adams 80. There was a band of showers that clipped the northern Berkshires in southern Vermont. 90 at Bolt Landing, Queensbury, 82 in Manchester, 89 in uh, Johnstown. So here are the remnants of Beryl, kind of on the western corner of Tennessee and uh, Kentucky. The track is going to take it just to our north and west late tomorrow and uh, tomorrow night. So that means more in the way of humidity, um, very high humidity, and with all that moisture, the threat of uh, heavy rain. Here's our future cast for tomorrow. Very heavy rain, some thunderstorms developing during the midday hours for the Adirondacks. Scattered showers and heavier thunderstorms here. That continues into the afternoon. This is at 5 p.m. Any storm may produce some localized flooding and uh, damaging winds, and some of these storms may have a little bit of rotation. Uh, this is at 7 p.m., still going on, and this will continue right through at least the first half of tomorrow night. Now, we look at the storm energy. This is the yellow and the red that you see here. That's the fuel for the thunderstorms, and it's very high tomorrow afternoon. That's why uh, storms could be strong to severe. Right now, based on the data, um, a low to medium chance of any storms producing tornadoes, a medium threat for damaging winds, low to medium on large hail, and a high possibility any storms could produce a very heavy rainfall. Right now, uh, there is a moderate risk of flash flooding, basically Glens Falls northward uh, tomorrow afternoon into early Thursday morning, a slight risk of flash flooding here. Potential rainfall, it depends where the storm set up. Widespread two to four inches of rain for the Adirondacks, isolated areas of six inches. That's why the concern is, greatest concern is north. The threat decreases to the south, but even around here, any thunderstorm could produce a quick one to two inches of rain, which would cause uh, some problems. 89 tomorrow, high humidity. To the north, cloudier, wetter, still very humid. 80 at North Creek, 90 at Hudson, Pittsfield 87 and 86 in Bennington. Tonight becoming mostly cloudy, warm and muggy, 74. Now early tomorrow there could be a shower, then partly sunny, 89, high humidity, afternoon showers, strong thunderstorms, so be on the lookout. That continues at night. Thursday, partly sunny, humid, just the chance of a thunderstorm, 89. Partly sunny Friday, not a bad day, 87. Scattered showers could be some thunder on Saturday, 89. Hot weather Sunday, partly sunny, 90. 92 Monday, a few afternoon storms. And even Tuesday, there could be a thunderstorm, but a high temperature close to 90. Lydia? Thank you, Cap. And tomorrow's.